so Munch Catering, our, our mission is to train cognitively disabled adults to work in the restaurant industry or the food industry by doing catering and they, they work and they get paid like a full wage for their time in those uh, enterprises and then from that they get the skills to move into jobs in the community. You know, there used to be this thing where people didn't think they had to pay proper wages to people they had a disability and so they wanted to pay like a, an actual proper wage and so we do, we have ever since. So this morning I was making cupcakes and cookies and icing them. So you put it like in a pipe thing or whatever and then you squeeze it with your hands and then you just go around in a circle. So we have something we call a drive through which is where people will order in advance soup or cookies or you know whatever it is they want to order off our menu on, on the website. Um, you know, or we'll put stuff on Facebook like, you know, this week's special, you know, whatever. So then people order the stuff and then uh, we have a, a pickup between 4.30 and 6. So everybody on the way home from work just stops and grabs their soup or, or cookies or whatever it was. I originally wanted to volunteer <laughs> and I cook, taught cooking classes for a while and then the manager position was open and they couldn't find anyone so I said, well, I'll try and do it, and here I am. Oh, it's been amazing, you know, working um, with the catering assistants and with the staff and just the people that support us. It's just been wonderful. You know, everybody has certain skills. Everybody has certain things they don't like to do and that they do like to do. So to me, like a, a good manager looks at their team and they look at the team members and they find roles that everybody can excel at. And that is how you get a good team. Um, and it's the same. So like our, our role is to figure out what the strengths are and what, the, what they like and then help them find jobs that will put them in a position to succeed and be happy. The benefit for the employer is that they end up with someone who's completely competent doing their job, completely reliable and isn't going to leave because you know, once someone who has been denied access to the labour market finds their place, they're going to stay. We had, had one particular, I remember, came in and she was just so uncertain of herself and her abilities in the kitchen and didn't think she could do it. And she became very successful, eventually moved out. She now cooks and posts all her, her things that she cooks online. And, you know, it's really great to see them progress in their confidence and their ability to find a job and to be successful. That's what it's all about.